Hey guys, something bigger than GCUB and PEC PG is finally out. The total number of opportunity GCUB rolled out was around 800 plus, and the total number of opportunity PEC PG rolled out was around 650 plus. But in this particular opportunity, we have more than 800, and I want you to take advantage of it, especially if you have been looking for opportunity to study in Brazil. This is one of the schools in Brazil that you will not like to miss. In fact, this school is one of the schools with highest numbers of acceptance recently they brought out an opportunity and a lot of people applied and guess what a lot of people were selected so many people from nigeria so many people from ghana i saw some people from pakistan in this video i'm going to be sharing with you this and i want you to apply for it as soon as possible okay this is knowledge blog <laughs> Registrations are open for the selection process of postgraduate courses at the Federal University of Santa Maria, Masters and Doctorate level. Now, I'm going to show you how you can assess this notice. Somebody from this school told me that, guy, what are you doing? You are just broadcasting the name of my school. I said, well, I really want people to have opportunity in your school and I want people to be there so that we can have lots of foreigners you know in these schools and you know it's also improve it also increases the um, you know the numbers of people in different communities over there ah so that without further ado um the name of the school is university of santa maria is in the uh towards the south of brazil the first thing you are going to do once you click this link this link is going to be in the video description below so look for this space where you are seeing editors pro editorial editors okay and i'm going to be showing you all the courses are listed you want to do agribusiness it is there you want to do accounting uh administration any kind of course you have been looking for is on this notice be it master's level or at the doctorate level this application is for 2026 admission the school i'm talking about is federal university of santa maria you can do a background check for you to confirm with me that this school is one of the best schools in brazil when it comes to um, numbers of acceptance when it comes to um, quality of education it is also my desire that you will apply and you'll be you will get this opportunity registrations are open for the selection process of postgraduate courses at the federal university of santa maria be it at masters doctorate level now i will show you how you can access the notice down below if you are coming to this channel for the first time this is knowledge plug and i share opportunities about coming to study in brazil not only in brazil and some other part of the world so once you click this link this link is going to be in the video description box once you click it i mean it will you will see this page and once you're on this page please try to do some background check uh beyond what you're going to get on this video you can also decide to do some background check about the region about the school but i am telling you to the best of my understanding that this school is a good one and it's one of the best schools so once you get to this page click here and it's going to take you to another page on this page you will see something like postgraduate 030 2025 postgraduate selection process and uh, read everything that you need to know the general notice is here this is first window and the first window started on the 29th of september in the month of october uh, already and uh, that reminds me happy new month everyone i'm wishing you uh, a progressive month every of your endeavors in this month shall be productive okay so this opportunity was published on the 29th of september okay so like i said all the courses that you have been looking for all of them are listed here you can see doctorate in administration and accounting sciences doctorate in agribusiness doctorate in agronomy doctorate in agronomy agriculture and environment doctorate in visual arts animal biodiversity soil science food science and technology biological science just mention it whatever you are looking for just scroll scroll down scroll down you're going to see all of them here not only doctorate we also have some specialization courses for example professional doctorate in management of public organization specialization in statistics and quantitative modeling then anyone there you don't see any vacancy that means it has not it has not been scheduled so we have master's degree in administration master degree in agrobiology master degree in agribusiness master degree in agronomy master degree in architecture master degree in performing arts masters in visual arts all of you that have been looking for all kinds of you know areas all kinds of areas of knowledge all of them are listed on i mean in this particular opportunity and please like i said try 
as much as possible prepare your document and apply or oh, it's very hot right now and of course uh, you will definitely see this kind of opportunity on this channel so without further ado i'm going to click one so i can also we can have more details as regard this opportunity so let me click the first one or let me just click a doctorate in agronomy so once you click this it's going to take you to this page okay so this page is going to give you detailed information about this specific one agronomy if you click another one you are going to get specific information about the one you click so once you get here what you need to do is to download this pdf file okay once you have downloaded it try to translate it to english and uh, read all the information and submit your application if you need further clarification each of the program has a uh, secretary right so and their secretary that you will see the email of the secretary so in case you need further clarification they call it do Veda. if you have any question any doubts you can send them email so you need some documentations when you translate this document to english you will have better understanding of what we have here and don't forget for foreigners and for brazilian this opportunity is open for foreigners and for brazilians so guys these are the documents that are requested or that are required for you to submit a uh, your application for brazilians and foreigners that are living in brazil these are the document that you need but for foreigners that are not living in brazil i mean brazil already you also have some set of document that you need to produce so guys um there's this this particular opportunity is also giving special room for women that are you know nursing mother and i'm wishing you best of luck in this application so this is an these are some of the document you are just going to be in need of okay when you are going to be submitting your application i'm wishing you guys best of luck you know there are so many opportunities in this school and they are literally calling you they are begging you to come and apply so the general quota is going to be four people with disability is going to be i mean the general quota is going to be level people that belongs to different um if you are if you are black if you are indigenous if you're clombola they give four quotas to them then people with deficiency they give them two the total is 17 and this 17 is divided into two different research lines this particular research line has eight and this other one the research line has nine okay so this is the step and for you to know how you can plan yourself very well i love this opportunity because everything is going to be concluded this year that means even before christmas you already have a kind of um plan you you already start planning yourself oh how you're going to travel to brazil because if you apply to this opportunity and you do everything everything that is needed i'm very sure you are going to be selected see this is one of the reasons i usually tell people don't submit a a shabby application make sure that your application is strong especially in the area of proposal and your cv make sure that this aspects are well taken care of and in fact this is where i come in if you need someone that can help you to write a proposal for an opportunity like this reach out to me i will help you write a proposal that is not plagiarized okay you can reach out to me via uh instagram or via my tiktok uh, page and we can talk on how to go about and if you need someone that can help you to do all of this and i will also prepare you for the interview because interview is also one of the uh, steps of the interview is one of the steps and if you need someone that's going to help you to do all of those things prepare you for interview do everything then uh you can reach out to me and i'll be much glad to work with you again guys i'm wishing you best of luck in your application if you are yet to subscribe to this channel don't forget to hit the uh, subscription button don't forget to like the video and don't forget to share with someone that might be interested don't forget again that information is power when you share information with people you are actually empowering them it might not be you that is in need of this information it might be someone else so please i want you to share this opportunity with them until the next video, atomize. Ciao, ciao.